good morning and welcome to another edition of tips and tricks hosted by yours truly chad fetter golf course superintendent at bogey hills country club st charles missouri as we approach this beautiful green i'm going to show you a tip that's actually going to save you strokes that's right low handicap high handicap if you follow these tips you're gonna make more putts and save strokes maybe not on a daily basis but on an annual basis you'll make more putts so as I approach this green well manicured tightly mowed it's a sacred area sacred area so uh, also referred to as a dance floor sometimes I don't like that terminology because that would imply that you're dancing around on the screen and leaving scuff marks everywhere so it's important when you're on the screen you're taking more time you're being careful of what you're doing and, and you're not dragging your feet around you're taking care of your equipment you know you're not taking gouges out of the green with your putter or anything so uh, really important the most important thing is golf is played into this well manicured cup so all other sports have a metal post goal like soccer hockey uh, a basketball hoop is is metal you know it doesn't change shape and it's sturdy this cup is you know made out of turf and soil and it's uh just a very fragile hole can you imagine if every every time the uh, basketball player like slam dunked that it would change the shape of the hoop and they'd keep playing it just doesn't happen it doesn't happen but unfortunately with the golf this cup is fragile and it's up to the golfers and the members to take care of it so that it stays the same shape doesn't have jagged edge, jagged edges it doesn't get uh you know stomped on and become smaller um also the footwork around the cup you know you go to pull your your ball out you don't want to be standing right next to it and twisting that's going to make for an uneven surface um, another small tip sometimes when we top dress greens sand gets stuck in the ferrule so if you twist if you twist the flag stick a little bit before you pull it out that'll ensure it not getting stuck and pulling the whole cup out um, so here's the tip every day we change cups and they look like this when we walk away a very well manicured edge regulation size uh, paint job perfect um, with with one employee you know Augusta National uh, at the Masters had to change a cup or, or fix a cup uh, on TV and it showed like four guys helping them um, not needed we do this with one personnel staff member um, but that's that's the way it looks when we walk away from it I can come back within four groups or so and the edges are all mangled have chunks taken out of them uh, the, the paint job is all scuffed up. That just implies that no one's taking enough care. Um, when you enter the hole, you got to think of the game operation, right? You don't want to hit the edge. You know, um, it's a perfect edge until you come with your big old sausage fingers and you're you're hitting the hitting the outsides and, and, and damaging the hole. You know, um, it don't matter. How many cups roll into the to the cup? It stays the same shape. The only the only difference is sausage fingers. Okay, so even with the flag stick in, and I recommend taking the flag stick out before taking the ball out of the cup every time. But even with the flag stick in, you just take your your hand and you make it as small as possible. You go in there, grab with two fingers, whichever ones, and then you carefully take it out all this really is is just care you just have to care a little bit take it out nice and slow and come over to this side you know you take it out nice and slow now ideally you just pull the pull the flag stick out now you've got a lot more surface area to put your big old hand in there Make it nice and small. Get go nice and slow. 
And look, I've just pulled three balls out of there and it's, it's still flawless. So you manage the hole. The groups behind you still have a regulation size hole, uh, no issues with the surface. And instead of that ball going outwards on a lip out, maybe that ball lips in because it's still the same regulation size and it's a flawless. That's how you're gonna save strokes and make more putts. So thanks for tuning in. Thanks for taking care of your greens. We'll see you next time.